words of Sri Aurobindo from the book The Mother, Part Two: Letters on the Mother, Chapter Seven: True Relation with the Mother, Page One Seventy Four. Topic: The Constant Psychic Nearness. Question: I am feeling very close to the mother, as if there is no difference. But how can this be possible as there is such a great gulf between her and me, she being on the supramental and I on the mental plane? For the Sri Aurobindo says, but the mother is there not only on the supramental but on all the planes and especially she is close to everyone in the psychic part, the inner heart. So when that opens, the feeling of nearness naturally comes. Date, 11th December 1933. Sri Aurobindo says, all that is needed for your psychic being to come forward and to open you to the direct and real and constant inner contact of myself and the mother. Hitherto, your soul has expressed itself through the mind and its ideals and admirations or through the vital and its higher joys and aspirations. But that is not sufficient to conquer the physical difficulty and enlighten and transform matter. It is your soul in itself, your psychic being that must come in front, awaken entirely and make the fundamental change. The psychic being will not need the support of intellectual ideas or outer signs and helps. It is that alone that can give you the direct feeling of the divine, the constant nearness, the inner support and aid. You will not then feel the mother remote or have any further doubt about the realization. For the mind thinks and the vital craves, but the soul feels and knows the divine. What you write here is an exact description of the psychic being and its relation to the mother. That is the true relation. If you want to succeed in this yoga, you must take your stand on the psychic relation and reject the egoistic vital movement. The psychic being coming to the front and staying there is the decisive movement in the yoga. It is that which happened when you saw the mother last. The psychic came in front but you must keep it in front. You will not be able to do that if you listen to the vital ego and its outcries. It is by faith and surrender and the joy of pure self-giving, the psychic attitude that one grows into the truth and becomes united with the divine. Date 26. Feb 1933 Question When I could not concentrate, I called down purity from above. At once the whole being was filled with peace and purity and without any difficulty. I felt the mother's presence in the heart. An intense aspiration rose from the heart from below, in fact, from all parts of the being. The heart was filled with adoration for the mother. There was devotion, a genuine surrender, a great relief in union with the mother. There was an intense aspiration for purity. Was it a psychic opening? Was the question. For this question, Sri Aurobindo says, Yes, certainly it was a psychic opening and at the point emphasized, which is very important, the opening to the higher purity. 
that is one of the most important things for the psychic opening and the inner relation with the mother date 14th july 1937 shorbindo says that which calls is your own psychic being whose place is deep behind the heart center many people feel at times the call for the mother going on from there it comes more easily in sleep or in a half waking condition because then the surface mind is not active so that what is going on within in the inner being can manifest itself date 29th october 1934 the next topic the true basis of sadhana shorbindo says yes that is the true basis in the perfect equality wholly united with the mother so the higher consciousness can be lived and brought even into the outermost parts of the nature date 22nd may 1934 the more the union with the mother increases the better for the sadhana date 2nd october 1933 yes it is a very encouraging progress if you keep the wideness and calm as you were keeping it and also the love for the mother in the heart then all is safe for it means the double foundation of the yoga the descent of the higher consciousness with its peace and freedom and serenity from above and the openness of the psychic which keeps all the effort or all the spontaneous movement turned towards the true goal date 10th october 1934